A wild druid has appeared. Works for me. He's gonna complete his quest this turn. Oh my gosh. Currently. Hello everybody, today we're trying out some spell damage shaman. So this is pretty similar to the spell damage mage I tried out a while back. So we've got stuff like primordial studies in here, arcane watcher, Raz Frost Whisper, Steward of Scrolls, and Sorceress Substitute. All stuff from the mage list I ran. But then some of the shaman specific stuff we have in here is Rune Dagger, which is a 2 mana 1-3 weapon that whenever you attack gives you spell damage plus 1 for the turn. So this combos pretty well with Arcane Watcher as well as Sorceress Substitute, so you can basically guarantee being able to play her on 6 if you have Rune Dagger equipped. Um, and then we also have the new card Diligent Note Taker, which has Spell Burst return the spell to your hand. This can be good for getting like extra Lava Bursts or like Molten Blasts, Serpent Shrine Portals, uh, extra burst damage to help finish off your opponent. And it also combos well with Lightning Bloom, so you can Diligent Note Taker, Lightning Bloom, Lightning Bloom for extra 4 mana. And yeah, so the basic game plan is basically just to finish off your opponent as quickly as possible with the big minions like Arcane Watcher and Sorceress Substitute. And then obviously with the burst damage we have with like Lightning Bolt and Lava Burst and all these spells in here. Also have Squall Hunter which gives spell damage plus 2 which is just really good spell damage minion. So yeah, let's go ahead and try it out. Watch your back for Doomhammer. Mm, this is fine, I guess. Okay, faceless is good. Double backstab. The Brotherhood Shell Cafe. Oh, my gosh. I mean, this plus a lightning bolt kills him. I don't know if he's going to trade here, but hopefully. Noise. Guess we just lightning bolt molten blast then. Save the diligent note taker for something else. Then we definitely marsh spawn next turn. is perfect for this actually. Maybe we just rune dagger. Yeah, I think we have to set up the rune dagger. Means we're not playing Marsh Spawn for a while though. Um go ahead and hit. Keep the one one alive. What makes something real? I mean, I assume he gave this the one health, but I hope it's this one. I mean, we're hitting anyway regardless to get this off, so I guess we're checking. Oh, it was that one, okay. Cool. I'm one of a kind. 
I'm a one of a kind. Still just trades with one of them, but one of them survives at least. Uh, we could note taker into primordial studies. And then play Mars Spawn the turn after. Oh, he's going face. Oh. Uh, okay. I wasn't expecting that. I like Serpent Shrine Marsh Spawn. Don't think we need Lightning Bloom right now, so let's just do throw that back. Okay. So maybe two, three, four, something like that. I kept the Lightning Bloom. I guess I did have the coin as well, so I could have. Serpent Shrine. I, no, I still end up skipping turn two, so I couldn't play this on three regardless. Yeah, we'll wait. Maybe play Diligent Note Taker. I'm afraid he just has like backstab to kill it though. In the also, that just kills it. Yeah, we're gonna wait to play the Note Taker. I can do this because I can coin out the Serpent Shrine next turn. Got a board. Can coin that out, but I don't currently have spell damage for it, so we'll just Serpent Shrine. Alright, not bad. Prevents this from hitting my face, and we get a couple taunts out of it. Never mind. <laughs> Both the things that transformed the two head charge. Okay, he's bringing the pain now. Good for him. Maybe we just Serpent Shrine again to clear this. Kill that, go face. Can also drop Arcane Watcher, expecting to Primordial Studies the next turn. What to do? I think we'll just do this. It's pretty good three drop. <laughs> So we can Mars Spawn Primordial and then uh, Arcane Watcher and play the spell damage minion. Oh, that was a good answer for it. Oh, Lightning Bloom. Hmm, maybe we just Lightning Bloom to play Arcane Watcher too then. With the Mars Spawn. Feral Spirit's not bad. Do I want to play Feral Spirits right now, or do I want to play Arcane? Arcane he can kill, but he'd have to trade with his dagger, which means I get the damage in anyway, so I think I'll just drop the Arcane. Otherwise I get overloaded for like, four next turn. So this still lets me Feral Spirit Primordial next turn, or just play the Spell Damage minion if this lives. I'll walk to no good. Me too. 
Let's go face Shadow Stone. The boar. Yeah. It's okay though, because we can put the taunts up. To find like a one mana uh, spell damage minion, which I don't think that exists. So he's probably not attacking this turn. This probably just gives me lethal, right? Because if I can drop the two of these next turn. So maybe we just ign ignore the taunt, play these two, lava burst, and then double lava burst the next turn. Probably just wins us the game. So let's see what this gets us. Um, We'll just take Thalnos because we can play it now. I'm going to go for the damage right now. Just ignore the 5-2. Could end up biting me in the butt, but we're doing it anyway. Taunt, maybe? More spell damage. I mean, double lava burst probably just gets us there right now. Definitely with the spell damage, but hopefully with the... If I can get some attacks in. What's he doing? Face, face. Oh, lightning bloom might just get us there. Yep, yep. He didn't kill this too, so he can still attack. That's eight, six. We just kill him with lava burst right now. All right. Ba boom. I think Warrior we typically do well with because he just got a bunch of board clears, which doesn't matter when we're just blasting them with spells. Look upon me, the aspect of death. Greetings, friend. So, pretty simple, just rune dagger into Arcane Watcher, I think. Could have lightning bloomed that out, but then we can't get the room dagger out. Yeah, we just play this. Just don't have like an ooze randomly. Alright. Yeah, it looks like just typical bomb warrior. Weapon? Yeah. Not the one he draw with her, that he drew with Corsair though. Alright, I guess we're dropping the other arcane. Play this first. Ooh, spell. Alright. That so he can attack. Mm, we're good. Got 12 damage on board currently. Uh, Blade Storm. Unlucky. Is that active? That's not active. Alright, let's drop this, see what we find. Um, I guess I'll just take Molten Blast. None of those are very exciting. Let's play it right now. Yeah. I was gonna play this, but this way I can play both next turn, cause, so I'm not overloading. Uh, I guess I could have attacked to get one more damage in, but that's fine. Treasure? Loot? What more can I ask for? Okay. Ooh, okay, we're doing that. Elements guide me. Maybe I shouldn't have face tanked that, but 
think I'm safe right I'm now. One of a kind. I'm one of a kind. So, as long as he doesn't have brawl, I think I'm okay. He had it. Let the six six live. Dang it. Yeah, I'm regretting face tanking right now. If we draw, get unlucky, and draw like a few bombs here, it could just be over. Um, I'll start with this. Explosive is pretty nice, actually. You can play it on that, get an 8 drop right now. Or I just attack to make use of the spell damage. I can hit 5 with that. I have the lightning bloom. Leaves me with three, so five mana next turn. So I can still march spawn explosive. I think I'll go for that. Then if this still lives, we can uh, explosive it next turn. Commencement. It's a weird card to play when you have cheap stuff like that. Hit, hit, two, six, eight, three off right now. I think I'll just take the Serpent Shrine. We're not killing him this turn anyway. So let's do this and then Explosive. Okay. Uh, I wish you could hit face, but I'll take it. This is eight, so it's probably just dead here. Must we draw four bombs in a row right now? Yeah, he's dead. Woo! Got it, we got it.